Good morning, y'all. Uh, it's Caleb. Happy Monday to y'all. Um, we're going to start off our day. We're going to go to the gym today. For everybody's having a good and blessed morning so far. Um, yeah, I'm going to hit y'all up when we get to the gym. We're going to do some leg day. Today is leg day. Monday's always a leg day. Let's start this day out great. Currently, I'm gonna show y'all what we're doing. Got this video ready for y'all, bro. I'm finna drop this. Uh, currently, right now, as y'all seeing this, just doing a little bit more um, extra editing if I need to. Um, sugar cookie, bro. Pablo's got the best sugar cookies, bro. I don't care what anybody else says. I say Pablo's got the best sugar cookies. And they're sent. Let's do it. All right, got my two photos sent. Thumbnails, if you want to use your thumbnails, bro, use Canva, bro. Use Canva, bro. 
This is not a paid promotion, by the way. It's not a paid promotion. But yeah, I mean, basically, we're not really finna be doing anything today. It's like really like kind of like a chill day today. Um, been just, I uh, went to the gym this morning, as y'all saw. Um, let's upload this video, watch some Isaiah's life, more of that. See some inspirations, how I can make my vlogs better watching him or comments that y'all put below my videos. Uh, yeah, that's basically what it's gonna be, so. It's like 50 degrees, so I was kind of hesitant because I'm like, you know what I'm saying? I don't really like the cold, but I want to get out and I want to run. So today, I posted one. Wanna say what's up? <laughs> yeah, I literally just been vlogging this whole entire time. About to publish this, this video real quick. Hi, right, what up, y'all? Um, So currently, it's mad loud, but currently, I don't know if y'all can really see me for real, but we are getting picked up by Alyssa right now. We are gonna go to the store, traveling with her. So when we get in the car, you guys are going to see her. <sighs> you wanna say what's up to the people? All right, see y'all. All right, y'all, so um, we are currently currently in Food for Less right now, just chilling. Uh, getting some food. Bro, she takes so long to get stuff, bro, it's crazy. I'm trying to go back inside the crib, bro. It is mad cold outside. She got me out here shopping with her, bro. Like, bro, look at her, bro. What? Alright y'all, so we eating right now, crazy? I didn't really show y'all, but like, I just hope everybody's having a good day. Like, I can't lie. Always make sure you get an icy when you drink. But yeah, man. I'll tell y'all what time it is real quick. It's 4.40. Uh, we finna run to Walgreens, make one more trip, and then, uh, yeah, we're gonna go back to the house. And relax. Probably watch a couple football games. But that's basically it. So, I'll see y'all. Those. Alright, guys. No way. You thought that was funny to record me? Guys, yeah, she's funny. upset that she didn't get her stuff. Alright, so, are we done now or what? What up, y'all? Hey, cooling, bro. I'm trying to get this film for y'all, bro. Um. Getting some more film. This is another, like another vlog. Um, so yeah, you know, we just got back home. Paid promotion. Ghost, bro. Get y'all a ghost, bro. A ghost will get you right, bro. Always, bro. We don't carry this into the next day, um, to be honest, because we didn't really do a lot today, except like just like really get groceries and stuff like that. So see y'all tomorrow. <laughs> Yeah. Are you gonna say hi? No, oh, yeah. I'm just showing them. Yeah, I just dropped, just dropped that video I was talking about, you know, something real calm. A sneak peek of that. You're probably gonna see it every time y'all watch this video, but like, yeah. Alright, y'all. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna carry this into the next day and I'm gonna catch y'all tomorrow. See y'all, bro. Love. Good morning, y'all. Um, it's approximately 7.57. 7.58 now. But now we're about to get up, get ready to go get our hair done, bro. Let's go get these two strand twists, bro. Because, you know, your boy need to be looking fresh at all times. Can't be going out here sad. I'm gonna catch y'all there. Um, bro. All right, guys. Um, so yeah, we're back. Um, <laughs> your boy got his hair done. I know y'all see that. The boy got his hair done. Feel me? Now we up. Feel me? But yeah, um, I had to chill right now. I just got some good Chick Fil A. 
I eat this up chill and I'll catch y'all when I go do something. See y'all. Alright y'all. Um We just came back from the movies. Uh what did we watch? American fiction. American fiction. Um so if you could rate it on a scale of one to ten, what would you rate it? Seven. Seven. Yeah. What about you? Um the sequence of it, um, I would give like a solid like eight or a seven point five. That was pretty solid. I didn't think I was gonna like the movie at all. I'm not gonna lie. But so why did you tell me? Because I wanted to try something new. I gotta come out of my comfort zone. All right. So the acting was really good, though. It was. It was good. I'm not gonna spoil it for y'all. So we in the parking lot right now, and we're gonna do some deep, some deep questions. What are three words you would use to describe yourself? Empathetic. Hard working. I don't know. Going. Okay. Three, you? three words I would use to describe myself: energetic and hothead. But I am a hothead. I gotta be honest. But. Okay. So. Oh, competitive. I have to add competitive. Okay, I respect that. Um, are you a good gift giver? I think I am. I think I listen a lot to like what people say they want. So then, like, I remember that I can give you what you want. Okay. For me, am I a good gift giver? Um, to be honest, I think I actually am. Like, the gifts that I've give, given people have actually been, like, some pretty thoughtful, like, you know, didn't care about the money at that point. Like, it was just, like, I actually wanted to, like, give them that gift. Out of the kindness of your heart? Yeah. Do you think dreams have deeper meanings? I think some do. What would you say, like, some are, like? Like, I don't know. Like, I don't really know how to describe it, but, like, ones that you, like, like, when you've been worrying about something or, like, overthinking something in your real life and then you have a dream about it, mm -hmm. I feel like that could, like, your subconscious is basically telling you what you should do. Yeah, bro. Every dream happens for a reason, man. You dream about something happening, it might not happen right away, or like, but it, I feel like it will happen at some point in time in your life. Would you rather spend the day at a botanic garden or an art museum? Uh, it depends on the, the season. Because if it's summer, I would definitely say botanic garden. If it's winter, definitely museum. I gotta go with the museum, bro. I love to see some art, bro. Art is like something that, cause you gotta think about it. Like, you look at art, there's always a deeper meaning behind the art that you look at. True. So it's like, why would I not want to be interested in that? Like, it's really sure. something. Hey, you never know what might happen when you go to art museum. Do you prefer cooking dinner or going out? I can't cook. Yikes. I can't cook. I, I can bake. I'm a great baker, but cooking is not my strong suit. I mean, I know how to like follow a recipe. I'm the cook in the relationship, so I'm cooking over going out any day. So, yeah, that's me. What does spirit, spirituality mean to you? Since I feel like people have different meanings of spirituality, but I'm talking about the one like Christian, like spirituality. How does God gotten me through a lot. Other time, like, when you go about your life and, like, stuff keeps happening, like, you forget to, like, remember all the grace and, like, just everything God has done for you. And I feel like, yeah, God just means a lot to me, actually. I love God. A good question, that's all I can really say is, like, there's a lot of things that's happened in life, bro, that, like, wasn't for God, bro, I don't think that, like, a lot of those things were, like, like, I would get through them, like, going through, going through things, like, on your alone time, bro, I feel like, without God there, like, I feel like you would be, like, fighting against yourself, and, like, when you actually, like, think about it, when you're fighting against yourself, and you actually come to a realization, and I don't say everybody gotta believe in us, because that's not what everybody's gonna think, but, like, half that time is God, bro. God is switching spots with you to let you know, like, hey, he made you think that it was you, but it was really him, like, helping you out through your mind. It's hope. 
Like without God, like there's not a lot of hope. Not <laughs> a lot of hope. <laughs> not a lot. No. Thank y'all for this. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. And um, I'll let y'all know when we get back to the crib. See y'all. Alright, what up y'all? Um, so we just came back. So thank y'all so much for watching this video. Um, it was amazing. I'm working on a new video right now as we speak while y'all currently watching this video. So I'm going to get that for y'all. I'm going to be posting more often because I found out what I'm doing. So I'm not like delayed, lagging or anything like that. So thank y'all so much for tuning into this video. If you please like, comment, and subscribe on this video. And press the notification button because it's going to help me and it's going to help you always stay in tune with what I'm doing on my daily life. So thank y'all so much. And on Boomski, thank you.